So right now, firefighters in Southern California, they're working to contain three huge wildfires. Evacuation orders issued for several counties impacting thousands. The largest burning at this time is the Bridge Fire. It's just east of L.A., 81 square miles lost. That's about four times the size of Manhattan. It's destroyed at least 33 homes, six cabins. Nearly 10,000 people have had to evacuate. Here's News Nation's Nancy Liu. Los Angeles is surrounded by three major wildfires, and now word is spreading about the causes of two of them. And that is stirring some anger. We now know one fire set by accident, the other allegedly by a serial arsonist. We're near the airport fire here in Orange County, and officials are calling this one a case of accidental arson. The fire broke out on Monday when an Orange County Public Works crew was using heavy equipment in this area to move some boulders while temperatures were in the triple digits. That sparked not just the fire, but some growing criticism of local government. As for the line fire out in San Bernardino to the east, it was allegedly set by a serial arsonist. 34-year-old Justin Halstenberg is facing multiple charges, including aggravated arson. According to the San Bernardino District Attorney, Halstenberg used incendiary devices to deliberately start fires just over a week ago. Halstenberg allegedly started two other fires that were extinguished quickly, but then a third attempt last Thursday became the line fire. The cause of the bridge fire is still under investigation. That continues to ravage the Angeles National Forest northeast of Los Angeles. It has become the state's biggest wildfire at nearly 53,000 acres, and containment is just 3%. With all three fires, the terrain has made things tricky for firefighters. Flames are in remote areas in the Angeles National Forest and the San Bernardino Mountains, so a firefight by air is often required. Much lighter winds are helping now since flames had been spreading sometimes faster than crews have been able to put them out. The bridge fire and other incidents have led to very smoky conditions throughout much of the region with many areas now under an air quality alert. Much cooler temperatures are here now, and that is helping firefighters to gain an upper hand. All three fires had broken out during a brutal heat wave over a week ago with uh, triple digit temperatures for over a week. Thanks so much for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.